just here at the train station, just waiting for my train to arrive, so head out of t No, wait a minute, I'm not taking a ride out of town. Do need to sell our sugar beet, so train has been called. Hopefully it arrives soon. But I think what we're going to do while we're waiting for said train to arrive, we've been here multiple times, but I've not looked for any collectibles in this area. So let's see if we can check out the entire complex. Ooh, nice. There's one here. Ooh, that's a new one, a trailer. So nine more of those to uh, find. So the train yards is a large complex with a little bit of a glitch going on there. Ooh, are we in the matrix? So we will continue looking to see if we can find any others while we wait for the train. Because what else are we going to do except parkour? Ouch, ouch. Uh, you know, and trespass around the station. So just continue to try to see if we can find anything and everything that might be of value. Whoa! Okay, nothing up here. Maybe we go up here now. Nothing there. Oops, uh, we're in a little bit of a jam. Our train still hasn't arrived. Maybe I didn't correctly call it, but hey. Let's continue the hunt. Ooh! Ooh, ooh! Nice! Found a plow. Let's check in here. Nothing there. Nothing in here. Let's go look in where we normally drop off. Still. Oh, trains there. Ooh, nice. Water trailer. Okay. Not that we're hurting for the money, but it's it's nice to get. So now that the train has arrived, just need to find the controls. I think they're over here, maybe. I uh, used them at the other train station, but where are they at this one? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, let me go find those. I should have been looking for that. Oh, yeah, we just need to hop in the train. That's what we have to do. We can get in. Uh, let's see if we can. Did that shoot? No, it'd be inside the tunnel here, or the, the building. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Brakes. They don't work that well. Apparently it is hard to stop a runaway freight train. So we have... Oh, you scared me there for a moment. There's our sugar beet. Assume this uh, is large enough. This one freight car. There we go, 42% full. So let's send this off to the wild blue yonder. Do you want to sell the train load? Yes, please. $25,376 plus a small rental fee. All right, perfect. So we won't run around any more of this yard. Well, we won't check over here. Maybe another day, but let's just, while we're here, just to do a final walkthrough. And then we'll get in our pickup truck and head back to the farm. Because we have more things to sell and we have at least one thing to buy. All right, so uh, I think that's it. Let's uh, head back to the farm and take care of selling some other goods that we have there. Now, as we roll back into our farm, we can see some of the things that we have to sell. Honey, lots of honey. Ooh, another full pallet. Yes, please. And then lots of lettuce. Now, 
The month of January is not the best month for that. Well, it's funny. I was a kind of expecting this to be a little more wintry. You know, we just lost some leaves on the tree, and uh, yeah, I don't mind seeing a little bit of snow. At least not, well, in game life, not real life. Double check what we have here. We do have our lettuce to sell. Yeah, next month is supposed to be the best month, so we're going to risk it because there's some really good pricing right now. So hopefully the $3,400, or, yeah, basically $3,400 here at the grocery mart uh, is even better next month. And honey, same thing as well. We have $3,200, but that's supposed to spike next month. So let's go to bed. Uh, there's nothing more here to do uh, this month. And let's get to selling some more goods. Ah, what a beautiful morning. Okay, so let's see. We've got honey and we've got lettuce. Let's have a look-see. So it's saying $3,300. Hmm. I think we'll wait a little later in the day to sell those. We can check it. Oh, lettuce is falling. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, sir. So Red Marble Bowling Restaurant is currently the best. I have not been to you before. Where are you located? Okay, all the way up there. So let's hop into our tractor and we will just auto load these up. We have a lot of lettuce. Oh my goodness. And we need to back up. Oh my goodness. What could go wrong here? Like everything. Okay. We will do Mr. Loop de Loop, our favorite tractor move. Let's just roll up here. Let's have a look, see, see if there's any other the spawn doesn't look like it. The good news is, it looks like we still have plenty of water. So we can head off. Now, we've been by this, what was it, the bowling mart before, obviously heading up to some fields to take on some contracts. But I don't think we've had to deliver anything there before. So even though we did do a quick search around the train yard, we will, I think as well, do a quick little walkthrough just to see if there's any collectibles at this new location. So let's get up there and see how much more money we can make by selling sweet, sweet lettuce, 8,000 liters worth. Oh, so glad I'm using my tractor instead of the truck. Uh, I think that would have been a much harder climb. So as you can see, uh, we're coming up on the bowling mart? What is this place called? I can't remember. Let's have a look-see. Yeah, the Red Marble Bowling Restaurant. Okay, there was bowling in the name. Um, so, kind of close. Whoa! Uh, dude! Of course, I might have done that in real life myself. Anyways, this isn't about me, this is about that driver cutting me off. Very rude. So let's see how much money we are going to make as we roll up here. In the trigger, hopefully it's all there. Looks like it's all in, which is good news. And the money is just rolling in. $26,984. That is awesome. So I think we can turn off the tag. And let's just do a quick walkabout. Since we're here, don't see anything on the outside. Oh. Wow. Um, somebody had a, a very rough game. 
So we will grab it. Don't have a cow, man. And I wonder, this this is just inviting me to kind of hop up here. Uh, okay, not quite. Huh. For some reason, that awning just can't seem to hold me. Let's try that again. Right through. Rude. Okay. So, probability of there being another... Let's pick up the basketball. Okay. The probability of there being another one here is low. But... We will leave no shingle unturned. I think this is a great spot. Oop. Oh, to get stuck. Oh my goodness. Had too many pancakes for breakfast. Just walk up along the roof line here. Sorry for being a little eclectic centric. But I am going to try to just do this when I'm at new buildings or going past something randomly as opposed to a regular basis. Okay, one uh, collectible. That is nice. That is helpful. Although it's funny, it's at a point where we have the most money we've ever had. $342,318. Wowzers. Absolutely amazing. So we are going to speed the time up just a bit while we go get the honey loaded up and see if we can get a better deal on the honey because all the places were indicating pricing was going up which is good news for us if we can take advantage of it so so far we've made some pretty good coin selling our sugar beet uh beginning of the episode technically in january some nice money with lettuce which is Probably the easiest uh, crop. Mm. No, I guess honey technically would be, because you don't need any inputs for honey. You just need to put down uh, a beehive. So the greenhouse is probably the second best way to make money. You just need to add water, and away you go. Although I think I've mentioned my understanding from others who have played Farming Simulator before FS22. So in FS19, I believe, you... It need manure for the greenhouses. Uh, there's apparently mods, so maybe at some point we might switch that up. Not too, too sure. But for now, we'll just use the base game uh, greenhouse. I will probably be looking at other mods in here in terms of some other tractors and implements uh, to give me some variety. And as well, maybe some that are a tad more affordable. Very busy today. A lot of traffic. Everyone's out for a nice afternoon drive. Well, I guess it's morning, so morning drive. So one thing I've, I found surprising, and I'm, I'm not sure if it's a game glitch, but most of the fields have nothing in them. Like, we've looked in the past, there are some canola fields, and I think there's a barley field. But not much else beyond that, so... Hoping uh, that's an issue that doesn't continue. So let's pull up here. Oh, and it's already grabbed the honey. So let's just move these pallets so that's easier than uh, the alternative. One more here. Not quite full, but so we know this is going to be the last pallet. Definitely a lot of honey. That's awesome. So let's have a look at the price of honey. It is still going up. The cereal factory is currently the best at $3,276. So where's that at? Let's go have a look-see. We have not been there either. Okay, so we're in this little 
town over here. Or part of town. This is this entire thing is a town. Oh, wayward, wayward. <laughs> we have one wayward palette of, of lettuce. We will uh, pick this up and... Or will we? It is not. There we go. It wasn't letting me pick it up. Oh, and it, okay. We're on the tractor. All good. Now we will find a spot to sell the lettuce because otherwise in real life that would just continue to wilt. But uh, we'll, we'll take the little, little bit of money, probably a few thousand dollars worth. Do a quick cut across here. Go to the light, my child. The green beaming light. I'm trying to think. Um, is that an Avengers? Avengers? It's a movie with a big beam of light like that. Nonetheless, we'll head towards the light. It's not too, too far away. We will be buying a field. Have no fear, we will buy something uh, this episode. Heavily leaning towards a canola field. We, we have lots of money. I have been checking the uh, used equipment sale and there's nothing in it that we need or want. And I guess those are two mutually exclusive things. Well, uh, they can, they, you know, not always mutually exclusive, but uh, in this case, yeah, there's nothing that we need in the sale. And there's nothing that I would want to buy as well in addition to that. So this isn't too, too far. Now I do have a habit of, whoa, whoa, running over people. No, that I don't have a habit of your, I swear your honor. Uh, now we won't go through searching any of these buildings over here. So have no fear. That is not the purpose. Uh, or, or should I say that's not anything that we will do today or at this point, we've already searched Two different ones. Oh wow, that's already starting to sell. Go, 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 go. $15,540 of easy income. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Now can we easily back out? This is a big trailer. This is this. I need out. Let me out. Okay, here we go. Phew! Alright, we'll head it this way. So with a lot of money here, we will do one last look. Uh, where are we? Not on barley. Back down the lettuce. Oh, so we clicked on the honey. We probably could have waited, but that's fine. We haven't been to, well, we can head back to the red marble. It's got the best price, it is increasing, but uh, we will see you up there and then we'll head back to the farm and buy a field. You can see what kind of hill we are going up here, which we did earlier in the episode when we brought Basically a full trailer's load of, of lettuce. We have one one wayward pallet that showed up a little late, so definitely want to take advantage of it and, and sell it because it's another year before we see a nice peak in the prices. So let's just drive through here, run over the basketball, and see how much money we get from this. Well, won't be too, too much. There we go, $1,651. Probably in real life not worth the drive all the way up to this uh, particular location because I think there was a closer one. However, you know, diesel costs are basically non-existent here and uh, why not? Ooh, snow. Finally seeing some snow here in February. It's a beautiful February day with the light snowfall. Doesn't look like it's going to stick. 
So let me just get back to the farm and then we'll look at expanding our farm by buying a new field. We are now home sweet home, but as mentioned, we're not done. We need to buy a new field. Well, we don't need to, but we're going to because why not? Now we should find a spot. Ooh, I wonder, this looks like a good spot. Thread the needle here. Pull up. There we go. We can still access the stone picker. Good for me. So let's hop into our menu here. Check out our farm fields. Now, I do think uh, there are more fields starting to magically have crop. Well, I shouldn't say magically because I do believe cotton. Okay, so cotton can be planted now in the month of February because we can start to see some cotton fields here. This uh, light pink color here, as you can see, flashing. But we, oh, I had a, like I said, the wheat off. So we have wheat, some wheat fields. We have a few barley fields, canola which definitely heavily leaning towards the canola field. No oat fields, no corn, see nothing. So there's not too many options here. So I don't know why there's so few fields planted, but if we come in, actually, sorry, we'll just remind you, we have field 60, 50, 47, 82. 22, 6, 7, and 1. Now, that's a package. Can't afford it. We could actually afford all these fields. It's a possibility. Can't afford buying uh, one because that's an entire farm. 1659, we actually could afford. That would be interesting. And I believe it was uh, 78, which we could afford the package, but they're all further away. And I like the fact that field 50 here, come back to the overview, is the largest field currently with canola. And we want canola for our oil mill over here because we invested $80,000 in buying that and it already ran out of canola oil. Well, canola to process uh, based on these two fields. So let's hop in. And we are going to, oops, let's go back. Uh, here we are. There we go. And buy for $114,072. Yes, please. We are now the proud owner of field 50, and we still have $245,000 left which we'll hold on to. We'll see how things uh, pan out as the months go by. Now, we're more than likely going to skip ahead to later in the spring, just simply because there's not much for us to do right now. We have nothing else to sell. Eggs won't be at a good price for a while. So if you have enjoyed today's episode, uh, I would appreciate it if you hit the like button. It allows the video to be seen by more people. And until next time. Bye for now.